Well, what is up my guys and welcome back to another BobTube video. So today we're on the randomizer and I've got something really, really exciting to show you. So as you can see, this is my base. It looks super chaotic. There's the, the organization is horrible. There's random floating flare heads, there's barrier blocks. We've got baked potatoes everywhere. It's pretty awful. And also there's these cobwebs. But that's not all we're here to talk about. We're here to talk about the new system that I've put in place for everybody on this randomizer server everybody in the community to use so this as you may know is the rapid minecart transport system so if you have items that you want to send but you're bu you're busy doing other stuff at your base you can just take them over here and send them to other people you can take up to five stacks of items per cart and you can just send them to other people directly without having to go anywhere let me see the potato so let's have a test so as you can see the cart actually isn't here right now i'll just eat another potato <clears throat> the cart it actually isn't here right now and um, what I need to do is press this button that says call a cart so when I press it you'll hear a bell ringing you might not hear that and then as you can see the cart is going to be brought to us just like so so this is a call a cart system so now the way you can send items all you have to do is stand on this plate stand on this pressure plate and just put your items in the chest so I want to send these golden boots to Mori and as you can see They've gone straight into the cart. You don't need to open it, but you can if you really want to. And then, I need to press this button, and that's going to send it off. And that means that it is all done. Now, let me cross the ice bridge and go to Mori's base, and let me see what the other person, the person receiving, sees as part of their perspective. So, if I head all the way over here, using the new head hitter, I can see there's this barrel that says, Take items from barrel below, leave barrel empty. So, there's some golden boots, and there's also some raw chicken that I sent a few weeks ago. So, this is why you need to leave the barrel empty, because then, if you leave it full, it might confuse other people, and it might fill up, and that will leave the system not working. So, always empty everything there when you receive a delivery. Now, as you can see, now the cart is on this side. The cart's completely empty, because everything is drained into this hopper. And this is how it works. I'm just going to demonstrate to you the calling the cart system from this side to make sure it works. So I'm just going to run the cart over to the other side empty. And I think it will be here by now. And I'm going to call the cart. This side doesn't have a bell yet. I'm still working on that. And the cart is going to come straight to us. So as you can see, you can hear the rumbling and ding. There it is. Perfect. So that's just something I wanted to show you guys. Just as a little bit of a... Um, a preview into this new system. Anyone can use it, as long as you're careful. Don't, you know, don't deliberately break it or anything. It's a bit delicate, but it should be fairly self-explanatory. Any problems, make sure to leave a comment down below, or message me on the randomizer chat, and I will sort it straight away. Also, if you've got any more suggestions for fun redstone projects, I'm completely up for it. So, that's all for me today. I'll see you later. Bye!